see stories from Google.com, we have mentioned that the GC Any Order app can receive order from a WooCommerce based website. Today, I'd like to walk you through the process of installing the Google WooCommerce plugin on your WooCommerce website and integrating it with the GC Any Order app by using the remote settings. Let's begin by assessing the website's backend. Go to the plugin section and click on Add New to upload the Google WooCommerce printing plug file. Once uploaded, active the plugin. Next, navigate to WooCommerce setting and click on the Integration tab. You should see the option for WooCom Printer integration here. This page displays information such as the printer username, printer password, and the REST ID, which are used for matching the GC Any Order app with the website. Now let's set up the integration with the GC Any Order app using the remote settings. First, obtain the terminal ID. To do this, go to the general setting and find the remote setting option. Here, you can set various parameters required for the integration. Before setting parameters, you must upload the GooCom SML file, which is be used for setting the receipt format. After that, let's modify item 5, 22, 36, 37, 58, and 59. Item 5. Enter your REST ID. Item 22. Input error 00 or 02 as the connection mode. Input the link for receiving orders into the item 36. Item 37. Is the callback URL. Item 58 is your login web username. Item 59 is your login web password that you can be set on the website backend. It's very important that you need to add AUTH in front of the password. Once you have finished configuring these settings, make sure to upload the changes. Great, with the settings in place, you can now proceed to place an order on the website. As you can see, the GC Any Order app successfully receives the order and prints it out. Thank you for your time.